Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I'll be comparing two popular parental control applications, mSpy and WebWatcher. I'll explain why, in my opinion, mSpy is the better choice. Whether you're in the market for employee monitoring or parental control software for your children, I'll help you decide which one offers the most value for your money. To start, let's talk about how to use mSpy. It's super simple. Just visit their website through the link in the description below. Follow the steps and download the software. You can then monitor either an Android or iOS device. Now, let's dive into the main differences between mSpy and WebWatcher and why mSpy comes out on top. One crucial feature that sets mSpy apart is its email monitoring capability. With mSpy, you can easily read emails right out of the box. Unfortunately, WebWatcher does not offer email monitoring at all, so that's definitely something to consider. But it doesn't stop there. mSpy goes beyond email monitoring and offers additional features like social media tracking, like Facebook, WhatsApp, Telegram, Snapchat, etc. You can see both incoming and outgoing conversations, whereas WebWatcher only displays incoming messages. One of the key advantages of using mSpy is its ability to record the screen of the phone you're tracking. This feature can be incredibly useful if you need to capture and retain video clips or recordings as evidence or for any other purpose. Unfortunately, WebWatcher lacks this option, so mSpy gains an immediate advantage in this aspect. This capability is crucial and gives mSpy a clear edge. Another valuable feature provided by mSpy is keylogger functionality. With mSpy, you can capture keystrokes on both iOS and Android devices. On the other hand, WebWatcher does not offer a keylogger tool. mSpy also offers geofencing, which allows you to set up notifications when someone leaves or arrives at a specific location. This feature is not available in WebWatcher. In addition, mSpy provides Wi-Fi monitoring, which allows you to see the networks the monitored device has connected to. Unfortunately, WebWatcher does not include this feature. If you want to get a feel for the mSpy experience before making a purchase, they offer a live demo on their website. On the contrary, WebWatcher does not provide such a demo. When it comes to support, mSpy offers 24 7 chat and toll-free phone numbers for assistance. In contrast, WebWatcher only allows you to submit a ticket for support. In conclusion, mSpy offers a range of features that make it a superior parental control application compared to WebWatcher. From email monitoring to social media tracking, keylogger, geofencing, Wi-Fi monitoring, and screen recording, mSpy stands out as the more comprehensive and user-friendly option. If we consider the importance of different reviews and their trustworthiness, it is evident that mSpy receives higher ratings and more positive reviews compared to WebWatcher. This can be observed by looking at platforms such as Trustpilot, the Android OS, or the Apple App Store. When it comes to selecting a reliable and trustworthy software product like this, it is always prudent to choose the option with better ratings and user feedback. Therefore, in my opinion, mSpy emerges as the clear winner in this comparison. That concludes today's video. I hope you found the information useful. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing to the channel. I would love to hear your thoughts on this topic, so please leave your comments in the section below. As always, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace out.